What up everybody, Jimmy here. We got weekly Mega Quest tips for the new week. First up, we have our weekly Rumble Master with Rumble starting on Thursday. As long as you are in a guild, go ahead and play those 30 Rumble battles. Uh, it should take you about three rounds. You should be making all your hits, whether you win or lose, at least try and get some points. Uh, we have our weekly Onyx Perfect Master. Win an Onyx Chapter 10 Plus without taking any damage. You can do that, um, where are we? As long as you are on Chapter 10 or higher. I'm on Chapter 9 because I was doing some other stuff for the dailies. So as long as you are on Hank and the Great Glass Elevator or higher, shouldn't have a problem getting that. Uh, just make sure you don't take any damage during that match. Weekly Navigator, play 50 Adventure Battles. Now, that'll be, uh, doesn't matter which level, which chapter. Um, I'm probably going to do uh, some lower chapters because I need to make some other additional combos, which we'll get into that in a minute. Weekly Fuser. So, you need to uh, take cards, level them up, combine them. That would be counting as a Fuse. Um, I don't have any of the level 1s at the moment, so we're going to go with filter and, or, uh, level 0. So we're going to go with, uh, here's a Haley. We'll do one Haley up to... Alright, so, I now have two Haley's. I can hit fuse cards, eventually. Um, there we go, processing. We do that five times. Let's see if that counted. Uh, where are we at? Congratulations, that counts as a fuse. So uh, level the cards up and combine them, then uh, do that five times, you'll get your weekly fuser. Weekly Gas Expert, that will be the icon with, go figure, green gas on it. Now, where do we have, we have the Atlantic City Gambler, that green gas blob down at the bottom. Enemy cards take additional damage once they've been uh, attacked. And uh, the card has that. So you'll want to play 25 cards with that icon. You can also make combos. Um, but that is the gas expert. Just 25 with that. Weekly combologist, combologist, whatever it is. Play 100 combos. You can do that in adventures. You can do that in challenges. You can do that in arena. I believe you can do that in rumble. Um, if you're still needing... Um, combos on Thursday, then I believe Rumble also counts for that, but a lot of people have that done before then. All right. We're going to skip the next one and go straight down to the weekly King of the Hill champion. Win 15 arena battles with a King of the Hill hero. Those are currently, once we get there, I've noticed this screen takes all the time to load now. Don't know why. So we are looking at Dale. We are looking at Bobby. We have, who's next? Hank. And we have John Redcorn. I'm waiting for him to put a Peggy hero in here. Um, that just seems like something that would be reasonable to happen. But those are your King of the Hill heroes. Um, you have to win in Arena. Ricky Spanish is not, but I'm setting him for something else. Um... Yeah, win 15 arena battles with a King of the Hill hero equipped. I did that a couple weeks ago. It was, uh, what was it, the Archer hero. And I'm sitting here playing with Zap as my hero, wondering why I'm not getting credit for Archer heroes, because Zap is not an Archer hero. So, um, yeah, he was one of those particular highlighted ones. And now we get, go figure, our weekly Hyper Trail Blazer. Play 40 Hyper Combos in Silver plus Adventure. Now you'll note that this is 0 of 40 at the moment. I have already played 5 combos. All Addicted, which are not part of the Hyper anymore since the rollback. Now, you'll remember we had a Hyper Trail Blazer Mega Quest previously. Please note, this was locked because we're going to send out something to address this after the quest has expired. We still haven't gotten that that I'm aware of, and now we get that same quest again. So, at the moment, we are going to be due two of these. Now, I have a hyper deck ready to roll. It has some blue characters and the green item 
Slurm Loco. Now, this will make the combo of Wired Stewie and Soda Chugger, both of which are hypers. Um, yeah, these, this is terrible. Uh, we can we can actually make the quest complete, but it would be difficult um, if you want to do anything higher than higher levels. So, yeah, that's the uh, Hyper Trailblazer. We're probably going to get another message about that, even though they've had another week to adjust this. Apparently, they just kind of gave up and said, we set up, here's our things for the uh, next week. We're not going to bother changing it. They had time on that one. All right, so if you've done everything so far, dailies and all that, you should be up to about 28, heading into 29. There's only up to 35. So we only need about 300 points, 350 points worth of uh, stuff. You get some gems, get some super legendary stones, and that's enough for a full pull. If you have the premium track, you get some power stones, some elite stones. Everybody gets mythic Luan stone or fragments. We get some mythic object stones on both sides. Character stones or mastery stones. I kind of like the uh, non-premium track for that one. Super mythic stones and another legendary stone pull. And gems or elite stones. After that, every hundred points gets you golden turds. So, yeah, depends on what you're uh, looking to save those for. We've got, I think, musical next, because we have... I want to say we got... No, not characters. We got new items somewhere. Um, where'd they go? Somebody said there were new items. We have... What do we have? All the way down on the end, maybe? No? I thought there was a new item somewhere. Maybe not. I could be wrong. Um, no, all of those look like stuff I've seen before. Wait, hold on. Karaoke Night, I believe, is the new one. Um, see how it only has two combos? Yeah, pretty sure this is the new one. Uh, we got Karaoke Night for music, so we're assuming music or Family Guy, because that is the thing, is next. So, yeah, we'll see what happens. Um, that one is now in the pool. But that would be your weekly MegaQuest tips for this week.